too much, bro. I agree. I can't live in paranoia. Like, I can't. It's all love, bro. Like, I f***ing love him, obviously. Bro, just because he doesn't know how to act. Okay, it's done. It's done. It's done. Our friendship is in no way, shape, or form done. Just the roommate aspect of it. Yeah. You know what I mean? If Ryan lived down the street, we need you need space with your friends sometimes. You know what I mean? Dude, you do, bro. We've never been we've never been good at that shit, bro. We're a good support group for each other, but we're just not good roommates. Dude, I just like I feel like jumping the gun on being roommates is like making me feel like not like just like afraid that our friendship can be negatively affected in any way, and I don't like that feeling at all. Dude, I think that we're all just such intense people, and living together might not just work. It just might not work. Bro, but like, I, I, that's why just, we're talking about our problems. I know, but what's the? I don't know, bro. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna f be honest. Like in my own house, I don't feel f like as comfortable as I should. I know, but like two days ago, you said that you felt more comfortable than you ever have. That like because Jersey's here with you, and you're so glad that I'm here. Like it doesn't make sense to me. Or like as much as you say I've been in it, I've always been. F hidden from it. No, so I, I have why it's important that we have these conversations. Like I fucking haven't been in it. That makes sense. No. And and if you don't feel comfortable, then like I get that. That's fine. No, no. But everything you're saying is fucking completely valid and you make more sense than you know how to do right. Man, man, that's the point. Yeah. You do, bro. And I'm glad that we had this conversation, bro. I just wanted to make sure that we weren't throwing you into a life that like you didn't necessarily want, even if it was like subconscious and like you, you like knew deep down that. Bro, I wanted want. to be like, come on, dude. Yeah, like no, you know that. I wanted to be a part of your guys' life for fucking ever, dude. Yeah. But I've just never like I've always just stood my ground. Like I never pushed the boundaries of it. It's the same both ways. I haven't even been able to allow my friend to do that. It sucks. It's the same thing. What's up, guys? I got. Can I continue? Yeah, yeah, for sure. Let's go, Mark. Let's go. Yeah. That was no. frustrating to me because. It's no, like, no, no, dude. I'm glad you're frustrated, bro. I'm glad you're frustrated. I fucking had a panic attack for a second, but hearing you talk makes like me feel so much better. It makes a lot of sense. Yeah. And like all you have to do is tell me that shit. And, like it's. Oh, we did. That's, and that's, that's it. it. That's what this conversation. And that's it. it. I'll say that this conversation right now is a lot more productive than the one that we had in the other room. Yeah. It was like there's too much emotion involved. We need to we need to like just calm down for a second and just like talk shit through it. So we're, we are best friends, bro, and like. I just wanted to make sure the roommate thing wasn't getting in the way of that. Yeah, 100%. Yeah. You know. Yeah. These people just know, I think these people just know we gotta get married now. Yeah, I think, I think we... You think I got a girl parent proposed to you? on me. I didn't do anything. So can you please just leave me alone?